Chosen is a jQuery plugin that converts long select boxes into a more user-friendly form element. The plugin adds autocomplete functionality to select boxes, and this makes it easier for users to navigate through long select lists. Go to the Chosen homepage to see it in action. In this video, we'll look at the Chosen Drupal module, which integrates the jQuery plugin with Drupal. Before we begin, download the Chosen plugin directly from GitHub and extract the zip file into sites slash all slash libraries. Once the plugin has been extracted, the path should be sites slash or slash libraries slash chosen. Finally, download and install chosen and libraries API module. Chosen works pretty well out of the box, but let's head over to the configuration page. Go to configuration and chosen. The most important field is the apply chosen to the following elements. Here, you can control which elements chosen will be applied on. By default, chosen will be applied to all select elements, but if you want more control over which elements it's applied on, then use this field. As an example, let's now limit chosen to a single select element. First, change minimum number of options to always apply and click on save configuration. Click on content, and what we will do is only apply chosen to the update options drop-down list. First, we need to inspect the element and get the ID. The ID for the element is edit operation. Head back to the chosen configuration page and add select hash edit operation into the field and click on save configuration. Now if we go back to content, chosen has only been applied to the update options drop down list. That's how you limit chosen to a specific element. Now let's head back to the chosen configuration page. Before we continue, add select visible back in. The minimum number of options select list is another to take note of. By default, it's set to 20. What this means is that chosen will only be applied to an element if it has 20 options or more. You can change it so that chosen always applies, or you can choose between five or 25. Next, you can change the minimum width of the widget. By default, it's set to 200 pixels. If you scroll down, you can change the way chosen searches select options. And you can also change a few strings that are displayed by the element. Let's now apply chosen to the tags field on the article content type. Go to content, add content, and article. You can see that the tags field is a autocomplete widget. We first need to change it over to a select element for chosen to work. Go to structure, content types, and manage fields, and click on edit. Click on the widget type tab, and select select list from the widget type dropdown list, and click on continue. Now if we head back to the create article page, Chosen should be applied onto the tags field. You can select an option directly by clicking on the field or you can search options by typing. 